Hey guys, it's Miss Halfcoat here. I wanted to share a read aloud for today called The Gingerbread Cowboy. Hope everybody's good. Hope you're ready for a story. All right, The Gingerbread Boy by Janet Squires and illustrated by Holly Berry. Once upon a time, in the wild, wild west, there lived a rancher and his wife. Every morning, just as the sun was coming up, the rancher saddled his horses and fed the cattle while his wife baked biscuits. Biscuits with butter, biscuits with honey, biscuits with jelly. Yes, those breakfast biscuits were plump as pillows, soft as clouds, and tasty as a big Texas barbecue. the page. Then one day, just as the sun was coming up, the rancher's wife decided she was tired of making biscuits, so she measured and mixed and she made gingerbread dough. She rolled that dough flat and cut out the shape of a boy, but not just any boy. He had boots on his feet, he had a hat on his head, and he had a big belt buckle made of spun sugar. Hmm. He was a gingerbread cowboy. She took raisins, candies, and nuts and gave him two bright eyes, a laughing mouth, and a cowboy vest with fringe, and she put him in the oven to bake. How cute is he? <clears throat> I sure am hungry for biscuits, said the rancher, learning, leaning over and sniffing the rodeo romping good smell coming out of the oven. He opened the door for a peek and as quick as a flick of a cow pony's tail, out jumped the gingerbread cowboy and he ran out the door as fast as his boots could carry him. Whoa, shouted the rancher. Come back, cried his wife. But the gingerbread cowboy just laughed and said, Giddy up, giddy up as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. He jumped over a horned lizard, gobbling up ants, and raced away as fast as his boots could carry him. Until he came to a roadrunner. I was about to have a lizard for breakfast, said the roadrunner, but I think I'll eat you instead. The gingerbread cowboy just laughed and said, giddy up, giddy up, as fast as you can. You can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. He wriggled through the corral fence and raced away as fast as his boots would carry him. Until he came to a band of javelinas munching on cactus pads. Gingerbread shouted the javelinas. Yeehaw! The gingerbread cowboy just laughed and said, Giddy up, giddy up, as fast as you can. You can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. He galloped past a big prickly cactus and raced away as fast as his boots could carry him. Until he came to a herd of long-horned cattle grazing in a field. Mmm, no more grass for us, they all cried. We want gingerbread. But the gingerbread cowboy just laughed and said, Giddy up, giddy up, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. He ducked between their legs and raced away as fast as his boots would carry him. Until he met some hungry cowboys riding the range, the cowboys yelled, Stampede! They wanted gingerbread too. The gingerbread cowboy just laughed and said, Giddy up, giddy up, as fast as you can. You can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. He turned down a canyon and raced away as fast as his boots would carry him. Gotta switch sides, sorry. Until he met a coyote napping in the sun. Now the gingerbread cowboy was feeling mighty pleased with himself. I've run from the rancher and his wife, the road runner, the javelinas, the longhorn cattle, and the cowboys, he bragged. And I can run away from you, too. I 
hope you guys can see this. The coyote smiled. I don't want to chase you, he said, but I can hear those folks coming fast, and there's a river just ahead. Hop on my tail, and I'll take you across. I can't let them catch me now, cried the gingerbread boy, cowboy, so he hopped on top of the coyote's tail. Look at that coyote's face. Hmm, he looks kind of sneaky to me. What do y'all think? Ooh, the coyote splashed into the river and began to swim. It rained last night, and the river was deep. You'd better get, better get on my back, said the cowboy, coyote. So the gingerbread cowboy climbed onto the coyote's back. By now, the cowboys, the longhorns, the javelinas, the roadrunner, the rancher, and his wife had arrived at the edge of the river. The rancher's wife took out her lariat and swung a loop out towards the gingerbread cowboy. A lariat is a type of a rope. Quick, stand on my nose, said the coyote. So the gingerbread cowboy jumped up on the coyote's nose. Ha, 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 shouted the gingerbread cowboy as the lasso fell short. They missed. So they weren't able to lasso him. Oh, wait, let me show you this picture. Here he is, down here. The coyote and the gingerbread man, or the gingerbread cowboy, cowboy is on his nose. But I won, said the coyote. He tossed the gingerbread cowboy into the air like a flapjack on a griddle and swallowed him in one gulp. A flapjack is another name for a pancake. That was a very clever, clever coyote. And that was the end of the gingerbread cowboy. Hmm. Okay, so there is a, let me move up here so you can see my face. There's an activity that uh, you guys are going to do with the gingerbread man and the gingerbread cowboy. So look for that on your assignments for this week. And I hope you enjoyed the gingerbread cowboy. It's one of my favorite stories. Any of those gingerbread men stories are awesome. So I hope you enjoyed it.